Hi everybody, Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com coming at you with Jaspie's memorabilia football frenzy mixer featuring a 10 box case of 2021 Leaf autograph football jerseys and a box of 2021 Hip Parade big box football edition. And college rules will apply if necessary. Sometimes um, products like this won't have a checklist, so if they're in their college uniform, if they're an active player, that'll that'll uh, go to the team they're currently on. So if we pull an Odell Beckham Jr. Uh, college jersey or something like that, or if it's like an autographed football that doesn't have a team attached to it, it'll go to the team he's currently on, which would be the Los Angeles Rams. If they're retired, they'll go to the team he played for the longest, according to ProFootballReference.com, and we'll use... Um, the games, game started columns as tiebreakers if necessary. Big thanks to this group for making this happen. Appreciate it. And there are the teams right here. Appreciate the teams. Let's roll it. Let's randomize names and teams. Six and a five, 11 times. One, two. Nine, ten, and eleven. Then final time. Got Allen down to Steve after eleven, and six and a five. Eleven times for the NFL teams. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And 11th and final time. After 11, we got KC down to Tennessee. We got the Giants Buccaneers game, Monday Night Football game on in the background. Buccaneers leading 17 10 early in the third quarter. All right, Allen, you got the Chiefs. Josh with the Dolphins. Chris with the Ravens. Peter with the Browns. Josh with the Jaguars. Dayton with the Washington football team. Asa with the Falcons. Charles with the Giants. Donald with the Niners. Ishmael with the Lions, Allen with the Colts, Peter with the Texans. Uh, Nathan, you got the Bills, Peter with the Eagles, Adam with the Packers, Regimel with the Cardinals, Steven with the Broncos, right there, sorry, I missed, lost my place for a second. Victor with the Vikings, Terry with my Raiders, Donald with the Panthers, Anthony with the Bears, Logan Collister with the Cowboys, Sean K with the Bengals, Josh Smith with the Rams, Kyle with the Saints, Barry with the Jets, Scott K with the Chargers, Adam with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers, Kevin with the Steelers, Allen with the Seahawks, Karen with her Patriots, and Steve Birch, Last Bob Mojo, Tennessee Titans. So let's sort by... Let's actually bring this down just a little bit here. Let's sort by column B, alphabetically by team. And we're going to pause the video. When we come back, we're going to see if there's any trades, and then we'll have the break. Stick around, BRB. All right, welcome back, everybody. A couple of trade offers were in the works, but in the end, no deals were done here on a Monday night. Thanks, everybody, for joining us. Here's the final printout. And the since we've got a lot of items, we're going to be a little bit... We're, we'll make the who am I questions a little more easy. So there's the, uh, the jerseys right here, and then the football edition of the hit parade right over here. So I think you can see it on this camera right over here. And most of these are probably going to be, I think for Leaf, yeah, I think all of them are going to be custom jerseys, so they're not officially licensed. So we're not going to take them out of the bag. We'll just keep them there. Let's see if I can, uh, I'm going to turn off that top camera. I don't want to reveal the, there you go. I don't want to reveal the jersey too quickly. Sometimes you can see the colors on from the top. All right, who am I? Obviously, all football players here. Um, I'm still with us, 67 years old. 5'11", 192, running back. 
Played for two teams my entire career. Drafted in the late 70s. Second pick overall. A Super Bowl champion. NFL Offensive Rookie of the Year. Four-time Pro Bowler. A Pro Football Hall of Famer. 12,000 plus rushing yards. 77 rushing touchdowns. And even 3,554 receiving yards. 13 receiving touchdowns. 398 receptions. Who am I? There you go. Douglas has got it. Tony Dorsett. See, Birch got it too. Nice. There's Tony Dorsett. There's the Beckett card. There's his autograph. Nice. Dallas Cowboys. That'll be for Logan and Dallas. Here we go, Logan. Next up. All right, all right, all right. Callie, what's up? How's it going? All right, who are you? All right, who am I? I'm an active NFL wide receiver. Former first round pick. Played for three teams my entire career. Was an NFL Offensive Rookie of the Year. A three-time Pro Bowler. As of now, as of this week, 506 receptions, 7,000, uh, a little over 7,000 receiving yards, and 51 receiving touchdowns. Two passing touchdowns, too. Who am I? Drafted in 2014, first round receivers, 2014. I'm currently on the, oh nice, Steve Birch has got it. It's Odell Beckham Jr. I think back to your 2014 draft class right there. Adam's got it too. Odell Beckham Jr. There's his autograph. Brown's colors here. Beckham Jr. And you got the Beckett authenticity sticker right here as well. Peter Lombardo with the Cleveland Browns. Cleveland, this is for you. Next up. Oh, yeah, I know who this is. All right, who am I? I'm an active quarterback in the NFL, 6'2", 212. First round pick, late first round pick. Played for one team my entire career. In my short career, uh, an MVP. And a Pro Bowler, a Heisman Trophy Award winner as well. I've got 82 career touchdowns. 9,532 passing yards. 3,554 rushing yards and 21 rushing touchdowns. Jerry Rice is a receiver. Derek Carr has not won an MVP. But Lamar Jackson has. Nice one, Adam. 
There it is. There's the jacks on the back. These are custom jerseys, so they're not officially licensed, but you can see the purple right there. Nice. He's pretty good. Baltimore Ravens, Chris Parent with the Ravens. There you go. I guess you can just write on these boxes right here. There you go. What's Daniel Jones doing? All right. Next box. Oh, I know this guy. Active running back in the National Football League. The NFL. Uh, former second round pick, one team my entire career, an NFL Offensive Player of the Year. A two-time Pro Bowler, two-time rushing yards leader, two-time NFL rushing touchdowns leader, 2,000 yard club, Heisman Trophy Award winner. I have currently 6,643 rushing yards. 65 rushing touchdowns, and even 92 receptions for 830 receiving yards and three receiving touchdowns. Who am I? Yep, SKS, G-Lo's got it, Derek Henry. I like his autograph, too. He's got a nice auto. Tennessee, Steve Birch, last spot mojo. Where did my chocolate go? Next box. Good luck. Yeah, some, some good names so far. All right. Who am I? I got, we got a retired player now. Retired player. Play for three teams my entire career. A former fourth round pick that ended up being a pro football hall of famer. From Allentown, Pennsylvania, went to Kutztown College. This should give it away. Wide receiver. 951 receptions, 13,000, a little over 13,000 receiving yards, and 87 career touchdowns. Pro football hall of famer. I'm pretty good. Seven time pro bowler as well. Not Jerry Rice, was drafted in 1985 in the fourth round. I don't think Jerry Rice is from Pennsylvania. Nor did he go to Kutztown College. I think Jerry Rice also has more than 951 receptions and more than 13,000 receiving yards and more than 87 touchdowns. Not Chris Carter, not Torrey Holt. Kutztown College. Last time I gave this clue, people got it right away. Yes, SKS, Andre Reed. I think someone told, I think it, may, it might have been Nick Jaspi who was saying that the football stadium at Kutztown College is like the Andre Reed Stadium. Nice one for the Bills. Nathan Smith with the Buffalo Bills. Buffalo! All right, 
There you go, Nathan. Oh, you got a hit. Nice one, Nate. That's you. Congrats. All right. Next one. Next one, I am a uh, former, as, as, uh, as Wikipedia put it, is a former, uh, is an American former gridiron football coach and executive who was a head coach in the NFL for 17 seasons. I'm still with us. I'm 96 years old. And I coached Andre Reid. Who am I? Should be pretty easy. Two-time Grey Cup champion, four-time AFC champion, no Super Bowls, unfortunately. Part of the NFL 1990s All Decades team ended up with uh, 143 wins to 112 losses, a 56.1 winning percentage. That's right, Marv Levy coached Andre Reid. There you go. There's Marv Levy. I get. Oh, that says Coach Levy on the back right here, and he hits you with that Hall of Fame inscription too. Nice. All right, and that's another one for Nathan. Buffalo! There you go, Nathan. Here. <laughs> yeah, Gilo's pointing out maybe coaches should be tying signing a suit and tie. Not a jersey. Alright. Next up. Another retired football player. Yeah, or maybe like a signed play sheet or something like that. That would be pretty cool. Or maybe coaches should do like an inscription should be like a spider two eye banana or something like that. All right, I am a retired, uh, a retired safety slash cornerback. Played for 10 seasons with this one team where I made a lot of my bones out of Purdue. Drafted in 1987, 10th overall. I also played with the Niners, Ravens, and Raiders. But this jersey is my is my original uh, is the team that drafted me. Doing a little co did a little coaching after my career was a Super Bowl champion and NFL Defensive Player of the Year in the early '90s, um, an 11 time Pro Bowler, a two time NFL interceptions leader, part of the 75th anniversary All Time Team, '90s All Decade Team, a 100th anniversary All Time Team, Hall of Famer in pro football and in college. Made 1,049 tackles, 71 interceptions, and 17 touchdowns. Uh, Scott K's got it. It's Rod Woodson. Nice. And his familiar Steelers colors here. Vanilla's got it too. Nice. There's the Beckett sticker right there. It's pretty good. Pretty darn good. Who's got the Steelers? That'll be for Kevin. Thanks, Kevin. Never ending jersey. We got three more jerseys left. There you go. 
So we've gone through seven. There's a few more. And let's pop open the rest of these here. Actually, let me just keep these over here. Usually, Donald, I wouldn't say the team that's on here. All right, who am I? All right. That would defeat the purpose of who am I if I gave away the, the pro team too early. All right, who am I? Are those really the colors for that team? Yeah, I guess it is. All right, who am I? I'm an active wide receiver. This is my college jersey right here too. Active wide receiver. Born in Miami, 5'10", 185, was a sixth round pick out of Central Michigan. Played with one, two, three, four teams my entire career. Super Bowl champion, seven-time Pro Bowler, two-time NFL receiving yards leader, a two-time NFL receptions leader, NFL receiving touchdowns leader, part of the 2010s All-Decade team. Career, 915 receptions, twelve, a little over 12,164 receiving yards, 88 total touchdowns. The central, yep, Donald, Scott, Adam got it right away. A.B., Antonio Brown. Nice. So there he is, in those central Michigan colors. And, of course, he's currently with the Tampa Bay Buccaneers. And that'll be for Adam. Congrats, Adam. I'm going to pause the video really quick. Got to run and <laughs> meet my food order here. Hang on. All right, I'm back. The gate, gate is open for the delivery. Hopefully, they'll know where to go. All right. So we got two more jerseys to go and then the five items from that hit parade. And the same college rules apply with the hit parade stuff as well. I think it is a it's a real uh, sort of certificate of authenticity card in here, Adam. Wow. All right. Well, uh, this is the uh, this is the running back on those Bills teams that Marv Levy coached, and Andre Reed's teammate. Was a va most valuable player, offensive player of the year in the early 90s. Five-time Pro Bowler, part of the 90s All-Decade team. Draft, second round draft pick, pro football, college football Hall of Famer. Over 12,000 career rushing yards, etc., etc. I'm pretty good. Bills, what a break for Nathan. Thurman Thomas, what a nice autograph here too. Thurman Thomas. So what, three out of the 10, right here is fine, thank you. You too. All right. So Nathan Smith, another Buffalo Bill. Buffalo! All right. And the tenth and final jersey. So three of the first nine have been Bills. Is the last one a Bill? Jim Kelly? Scott Norwood?
All right, not a bill. All right, a retired wide receiver, 78 years old right now, 6'1", 190, probably my playing days, was drafted in the NFL draft and the AFL draft, played for one NFL team my entire career, and played a little Canadian football as well after my NFL days. Played one season with the Montreal Alouettes. Super Bowl champion, a Super Bowl MVP, a four-time Pro Bowler, an NFL receptions leader, an AFL champion as well, a two-time AFL All-Star, college and pro football Hall of Famer, career 589 receptions, 8,974 receiving yards, and 76 receiving touchdowns. And I was, where did I go to college? Florida State. And guess what? I've got a college award named after me. I've got an award named after me. The blank blank award. While I lacked, according to Wikipedia, while I lacked the breakaway speed to be a deep play threat, I was one of the most sure-handed and consistent receivers of my day with the propensity for making spectacular catches. Known for running smooth, precise pass routes. And the, the award that's named after me is given annually to the most outstanding receiver in NC. There you go, Barry Roberts. I thought the award thing would really give it away. It's Bolitnikov, Fred Bolitnikov for my Raiders. <laughs> Definitely before my time, but, but hey, still a legend. There's his autograph right there, the Beckett sticker over here. Nice, for the Raiders. And that is Terry Cahill with the Las Vegas Raiders. Nice finish. All right, there you go, Terry. Thanks for getting in. All right, but wait, there's more. There's the big box. Football edition right here. So let's see what let's see what's in here. There's my knife. So there's a lot of brown paper crinkled up in here, so adjust your volumes if necessary. Here's a photo. Feels like a full-size helmet here. Feels like a football. Jersey and mini helmet. You can share your hit with Hit Parade if you'd like. Empty box. All right. Well, see, since we've seen a ton of jerseys already, let's let's just get another one knocked out really quick. All right. Ooh. Is that another Buffalo Bill? <laughs> yeah. Look at this. The Bills parade keeps going. That's Bruce Smith this time. You might you might have that whole that whole team there. And this is an officially licensed jersey. Everyone saw the color already, so I'll just pull out the jersey. We've seen enough jerseys. Bruce Smith. Nike jersey right here. That's awesome. Now these are officially licensed, so it's worth taking a look. This is new guy mojo right here. Congrats, Nate.
And this is a completely different product too. Completely different company. Leaf was the first one. This is Hit Parade. This is awesome though. Got all the officially licensed stuff here. And I'll fold, I'll fold this up nicely after the break. These I actually have to do, I actually do have to write down on the, I keep losing my sharpie. All right, well, hey, Nathan Smith, have yourself a break. All right, hey, there you go. Congrats. All right, let's get into let's get into the photo. I usually have the name of the player on the one of the end caps here. Is this a bill? I've never heard of this player before. All right. Um, a former American football wide receiver who played in the NFL from 86 to 98 from Stockton, California, attended Franklin High School and went to San Diego State. Played for one, two, three, four, five teams my entire career, two-time Pro Bowler and one-time All-Pro. Drafted in 1986 in the second round, pick 43, 6'1", 175. As a member of this team, I would catch 305 passes and 27 touchdowns in six seasons, earning the praise of my coach, who stated I was the one of the best receivers this team ever had. Hmm. Not sure if... Let's see what team... Here's the... David Adams authenticity stuff here. Oh, this is a tiny photo. And you remember this guy? Webster Slaughter. I don't think the Panthers were around in the 80s. Um, yeah, he played with the Browns from 86 to 91. Drafted on the recommendation of old uh, of old uh, Browns legend Paul Warfield. Yeah, Webster Slaughter. SKS remembers him as a as a great return specialist in Tech Mobile. All right, well, Cleveland, this is for you. That will be for Peter and the Browns. All right, mini helmet? Mm, I could use, use the player name here. I'm not very good at identifying these guys just with the autograph. Oh, there it is. Oh, okay.
Another wide receiver, active wide receiver this time. Um, have played for one team my entire career. 6'1", 190 out of Fort Lauderdale, Florida. 26 years old right now. Out of Alabama. One team my entire career. Was a second team All-Pro. PFWA All-Rookie Team. First team All-SEC. Two-time college football champion. Two-time SEC champion. As of now, 248 receptions. 3,342 receiving yards. And 28 receiving touchdowns. I'm only about, what, three, three, four years into my career? And I've got a younger brother who also plays in the NFL. Yep, there you go, Adam. Calvin Ridley. Very cool helmet right here as well. There you go. The, the, the white ink autograph looks pretty cool on this matte black helmet. Nice, so that goes to Asa and the Atlanta Falcons. No, I guess technically not an active player. I think he's on he's on IR right now. Is he on IR right now? It says reserve. Technically injured, so yeah, not active right now. I'm an injured player in the National Football League. There you go, Asa. All right. Let's go... Let's go full-size helmet first. All right, I see the helmet. Oh, he's on leave, not injured. Here's the identifying sticker here. I'm just going to have to figure it out. Usually they have a little, little name sticker here. Oh, there it is. All right, I got it. I found it. All right. Um, I am. Am I actually active? I am. I'm roster status active, it says according to Wikipedia. I'm an active tight end for the National Football League. Played for one team my entire career. An eighth overall pick. 6'5", 250, went to college at Iowa, which I feel like they produce a lot of good tight ends, right? I was a pro bowler last year for the first time. Uh, and, and in my short career, I have 153 receptions, 1,589 receiving yards, 10 receiving touchdowns. I think Travis Kelsey has a little more than 10 receiving touchdowns. So does Kittle. But SKS has got it, TJ Hawkinson. There you go, that's pretty cool. Lions, Detroit Lions, that'll be Ishmael. Nice helmet. So you got the NFL card, or the uh, Beckett card right here. Nice Lions logo up front. Nice glittery helmet. The Lions logo is I always thought was really cool. And there's his autograph right there. Nice. The corresponding Beckett sticker and Detroit on the back right over here as well. Nice helmet for Ishmael and the Detroit Lions on the board. All right, and the last item coming up, which feels like a football. Oh, 
And in case you're disputing the auto, there it is. TJ Hawkinson is the auto right there as well. All right. Ishmael, thank you for getting in. Congrats to you. Appreciate it. Final auto coming up. Fingers crossed, ladies and gentlemen. It's a pretty fun break. We always enjoy playing a little bit of the Who Am I? Helmet in there after it. Let's get, let's get this going here. So there's the name sticker right here. All right. All right. Who am I? I am also an active running back in the National Football League. A first round pick, picked fourth overall. Um, played for two teams my entire career. This, since this is an a, a autographed football, it's most likely not going to have like the team logo stamped in there or anything like that. So this will obviously go to the team that I'm currently on. A one-time Super Bowl champion. It was a consensus All-American, a first-team All-SEC. Went to LSU. Um, a career 3,484 rushing yards, 27 rushing touchdowns, 208 receptions for over 1,500 receiving yards and two receiving touchdowns. I'm actually playing today. I've got nine carries for 34 yards and six receptions for 39 yards. Have I improved my receiving game a little bit? I've been catching the ball out of the backfield. Yeah, Adam, Leonard Fournette. There it is. Nice. There's the authenticity sticker right here. There you go. You can kind of see it right there. That's how he sees passes. Actually, it would be this way out of a right. I guess he'd see the pass lefty like this. Still has the retail tag on there. Nice. And that is um, for Adam Kupperman, Tampa Bay Buccaneers. And there you go, boys and girls. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. That was a two-case break. That was Jaspie's memorabilia football frenzy mixer. Um, a case of those Leaf autograph jerseys. And then Hit Parade Big Box Football Edition coming at you right here as well. Thanks for watching. Thanks for breaking with us. I'm Joe for jazbeescasebreaks.com, and I'll see you next time for the next one. Bye-bye.